I have the Samsung Galaxy S23 here and in today's video I want to show you how to disable access to the camera and the microphone. This can be done from within the settings application but you can also use a couple of quick settings tiles to do this as well. All we have to do is open up the settings app and then we're going to scroll down a little bit until you find the security and privacy section. Now we're going to scroll down a little bit again so that you can tap on the privacy option. And from here you should see a controls and alerts section. So by default you're going to see access to the camera and the microphone is enabled. And just with a simple tap we can disable access to the camera or the microphone or both. With these toggles disabled, you can then test to see if these sensors are actually off by opening up the camera application or by trying to use the microphone for something. You can see that this prompt will appear if we use an app or a feature that tries to access a sensor that has been disabled in this way. We can either choose to enable the sensor from here, or we can continue to keep this type of access disabled. If you would like a faster way to access these toggles, we can do this by expanding the Quick Settings panel, tapping the three dot menu icon at the top right, and then selecting the edit buttons option. Here you're going to be shown a list of inactive quick settings tiles at the top and we can drag these to our active panel down here at the bottom. So we're going to bring in our microphone access tile and our camera access tile down to the bottom which is our active quick settings panel and now just tap the done button at the bottom and you should now see these newly added quick settings tiles in our panel. And these work just like the toggles did in the settings application. So we can enable access to these sensors if they have been disabled previously or we can tap one and then confirm that we want to disable access. I have read that some people with a mid-range or budget Samsung Galaxy device does not have both of these toggles in that privacy section of the settings app. However, you should still be able to block access using a hidden feature tucked away in the developer options menu. This can also be used on the Galaxy S23, Galaxy S22, and all other Galaxy S series smartphones if you don't trust Samsung's built-in method. See, a couple of years ago with the release of Android 10, I did a video showing a new hidden developer options feature that allowed you to create a quick settings tile that turned off all of your device's sensors. This disables the camera sensors, the microphone sensors, the gyroscope sensor, and more. So if you would rather do this, I'll link to that guide in the video description below, but it just requires you to enable developer mode and then toggle on a sensors off quick settings tile that you'll find in your quick settings panel. You'll notice that when we enable the sensors off tile, and then we use an application or service that tries to use that sensor, instead of getting a prompt telling you that the sensor has been blocked and giving you an option to enable it, we're simply told that the security policy prevents the use of the camera. And if you try to use something with a microphone, then you'll notice that it is not going to pick up anything from that mic. I have read a comment here on the channel saying that Samsung will go out of the way 
to enable these sensors after a certain period of time. If you have enabled the sensors off tile, but I have yet to see that on my device. If that's something you have experienced, then let me know down in the comment section below. And let me know if blocking access to the camera and microphone is something that you do on your Android smartphone or tablet. I have a few tablets around the house that I use only for media consumption that have no need for a camera or a microphone and disabling access to them is a great way to give peace of mind.